Hi, I'm Redheaded Riding Hood, Red for short. I'm gonna read you this today. I thought it was really, really good. It's a verse from Luke 10. Mary has chosen the good portion which shall not be taken away from her. That's the story of uh, Mary and Martha, where Martha was working and busy and uh, probably preparing food and all of that for Jesus. And Mary was just sitting at Jesus's feet, listening to him. And Martha said, um, tell, tell my sister to help me. Um, but Jesus told Martha, you know, you're worried and troubled about many things, but Mary has chosen the good portion which shall not be taken from her. So I'm going to read this devotion. It's very good. It's from Letting God, Christian Meditations for Recovering Persons by A. Philip Parham. A minister once asked a person he was counseling if he had any trouble making decisions. He answered, well, yes and no. Sounds like red. The word intelligence comes from two words. Inter meaning between and leisure meaning to choose. An intelligent person is one who has learned to choose between good and evil, truth and falsehood, love and hate, gentleness and cruelty, humility and arrogance, and life and death. A Southern preacher said, God always votes yes, the devil votes no, and your vote decides the election. A Christian vote is always positive. Recovery demands a clear choice for life. To live, one must say yes to recovery and health and no to compulsiveness and disease. We have power to choose which way we want to go. We cannot recover by wanting recovery or even by choosing the right road. We, yet we begin the process of recovery with our desire and our choice. We need a lot more help along the way. But no step among the 12 can be taken without our consent. God calls us, God calls us, he never compels us. However, once we answer the call and choose his way, he gives us the power and courage we lack. Our entrance into new life is our own responsibility and and then our recovery becomes God's own doing. But the first move is our choice. Choose life. Jesus, make my choices positive ones. Increase my intelligence. Amen. I felt I needed um, to record this and post this when I read it. Um, I said on my community tab recently to choose life and I put a little reel that I um, found on Instagram I think it was um, we can't choose for anyone it, and he says here even, even God can't make us make the right choice but um, 
when we make the right choice, God helps us. So, anyways, I feel this was a very, very important devotion. And when I read it, I wanted to share it with you. Don't say that no one cares for you, because I do, and God does too. Pray for Red, because Red is praying for you.